Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the 1111 AM Fireside Chat on this somewhat windy Wednesday, April the 27th, 2022. I am Vicki Meeks Miller, your Community Engagement Manager with a Community Engagement Update. I hope you tuned in on Monday uh, for this month's edition of Geese Speaks, uh, where our special guest was uh, Lake Retreat resident David Snow from um, Richfield's own flock. And Mr. Snow took us uh, to Hollywood in the 40s, 50s, and 60s, shared his uh, experiences from his racing days that included many stars, and even shared some of his kicks from Route 66. So if you missed it, be sure to go to YouTube, search for, and then click on the Richfield Living page to enjoy this most enlightening stroll down memory lane. We certainly do thank um, Mr. Snow for sharing his delightful stories from his exciting life. And we thank those who joined us here in the community room for the broadcast. We also thank each of you who joined us on Friday for the Environmental Well Power Earth Day celebration at the Lower Lake. Um, we especially thank uh, Gretchen Johnson of Knollwood for initiating the event and for appearing with me last Wednesday to share her insights on the importance of Earth Day. It was such a beautiful day on Friday. We couldn't have ordered a better day um, we, uh, where we made declarations and sang um, and planted a beautiful bear berry white hydrangea and five May night salvia bushes. And they are located um, in the garden right by the footbridge um, by the lower lake. So be sure to stop by and keep an eye on the growth of those beautiful plants and bushes. Um, we also um, dedicated the area in the front of the lower lake as the sunflower garden that will include uh, the sunflowers planted at the Stations of the Cross um, and other sunflowers uh, that will welcome guests as they uh, turn into Knoll Ridge um, at the front of the campus. And of course, um, this was done um, in honor of the victims also of the Ukraine. So a special, special thanks to Shirley Jerusik, um, who is our horticulture guru, who um, made sure that we had wonderful plants to adorn our earth here at Richfield, and Susan Bryant for connecting our bodies to the environment as well as Tanya Woolwine, um, our, our official photographer, and all of the residents who attended and even got your hands dirty um, helping to plant those wonderful plants. So um, we look forward to celebrating Earth Day next year, and um, we certainly did enjoy it on Friday. We even had a flyover an official flyover by one of the geese. So that did make it official. <laughs> so thanks to all. Um, uh, we also thank each of you for attending um, and those of you who even exhibited at the Spring Arts and Crafts Fair on this past Saturday here in the community room. Thank you to all who donated baked goods, and purchased um, those baked goods in support of Richfield's Relay for Life team. Um, that exciting event um, in which Richfield is sponsoring a team and um, also fundraisers uh, to collect money for that um, team. And that event will be held um, on June the 11th at the Salem Civic Center. Another great fundraiser for the Relay for Life will be uh, a hibachi lunch on Tuesday, May the 24th from 11 a.m. until 1 p.m. Tickets must be pre-purchased and you can do so 
at the front desk of the town center. So there's a wonderful menu planned. You can choose steak or, excuse me, not steak, chicken or shrimp or vegetarian stir fry. So please be sure to support this um, worthy cause. Now, the upcoming events um, are as follows. Are you ready for some cornhole? The cornhole tournament where the residents of Richfield will be taking on Richfield team members will begin today at 2 o'clock p.m., right here in the community room. Be sure to come out and cheer on the teams and um, have some fun with your friends and neighbors. On tomorrow, on Thursday, April 28th, the Leap Mobile returns um, Thursday morning at 10 a.m. at the Lower Lake. Also at 10 a.m., tune in for Bible study with Chaplain Gary here on Channel 62 or join him here in the chapel. Also on Thursday, we look forward to tasting all of the wonderful submissions for the Cobbler Bake Off at 2 o'clock p.m. in the Roost 52. All residents are invited uh, to enter, and may the best cobbler win once again. Contact Susan Rogers at 540-384-384. 1198 for information. Then at 3.30 on Thursday, enjoy a game of ladder toss on the Oaks Lawn. So after eating that uh, delicious cobbler, go and burn those calories off by um, joining us for ladder toss. Once again, 3.30 on the Oaks Lawn. Then on Friday, as well as every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, it's devotion time with Chaplain Gary here on Channel 62 and um, in the chapel. Then at 10 a.m., um, gather in the town center to join your friends and neighbors for a walk on the Greenway at Green Hill Park. You can walk at your own speed, rest, relax, and enjoy the landscape. Um, and once again, the bus departs from the town center at 10 o'clock a.m. The special Friday edition of the 1111 a.m. Fireside Chat with Chaplain Gary and his special guests will continue to provide information on things that we all need to know when we lose a loved one. Um, so please be sure to join Chaplain Gary at 11, 11 a.m. on Friday right here on Channel 62. And um, you are welcome to join them here in the uh, chapel as well. The special Friday broadcasts are available on Rich, Richfield's YouTube channel as well. Then at 2 o'clock p.m., those celebrating birthdays in April... Um, we'll be having a um, April birthday party um, in the Regency Room at Ridgecrest at 2 o'clock p.m. In addition, all residents who have recently moved to, Rich, to Richfield are invited to come and meet your new neighbors as well. So once again, on Friday, 2 o'clock p.m., in the Regency Room at Ridgecrest. On Saturday, uh, the Bible study replays um, at 11 a.m. in case you missed it on Thursday. Um, and also, there are lots of physical well power programs available on Channel 62 each weekday and on the weekends. Um, so um, there are also rebroadcasts of spiritual and intellectual well power programs um, such as the town hall meeting that took place on Thursday of last week that is rebroadcast through tomorrow at 7 p.m. on channel 62. So there's a whole schedule of programs that are available on channel 62 throughout the week. Um, there are one, two, four classes on Saturday, uh, physical well power classes on Saturday, and three on Sunday. So um, when the wellness studio and the wellness center 
are closed, then you can still get your exercise as well as spiritual and intellectual well power information on Channel 62. This schedule is available in the town center. Then on Saturday night, the dinner special from 4.30 until 6.30 p.m. in the Answer Cafe will include beef brisket Philly, which is sliced beef brisket, cheddar cheese, sauteed onions, peppers, and mushrooms on a hoagie with barbecue sauce for only $9.00. Fried chicken salad, which consists of romaine, lettuce, fried chicken strips, corn nuts, cherry tomatoes, shredded cheese, cucumber, and honey mustard dressing for only $8. And, oh, this sounds like a favorite, shrimp and grits. Creamy grits with saucy shrimp, onions, peppers, and bacon for only $10. Um, side orders of roasted wedge potatoes for $2. And your desserts include New York cheesecake with choice of caramel or chocolate topping for $4 or hand-dipped Hershey's ice cream. And each dinner entree comes with dinner rolls and butter. So that sounds delicious as well. So that is on Saturday in the Answer Cafe from 4.30 until 6 p.m. On Sunday, join Chaplain Gary and your friends and neighbors for Sunday morning worship service here in the chapel at 10 o'clock a.m. or tune in to cha on Channel 62. If you miss it um, here live or um, in person, the chapel service, uh, month Sunday service, does rebroadcast every Monday and Friday at 4 o'clock p.m. on Channel 62. The all-you-can-eat Sunday brunch follows from 11 a.m. until 1 o'clock p.m., and that menu this week will include a Denver scramble, baked apples and oats, herb-crusted pork loin, sweet potato casserole, roasted Brussels sprouts, tossed salad, and assorted cookies. All you can eat for only $10.99 um, per person, and that does include your beverage. Of course, um, for each of, the, of these dining events, reservations are recommended. Um, to make reservations, please call 540-283-2822, and reservations are required for large groups. Now, um, the menus uh, for lunch and dinner for the remainder of the week uh, include um, today for lunch, um, there are two slices of pizza and a side salad. On Thursday, uh, the loaded baked potato bar and bowl of chili. On Friday, breaded filet of fish sandwich with french fries and slaw. On Saturday, a meatball, meatball sub and side potato salad. And this week's grill special all week is the Philly cheese steak um, for only $7.95. The soups of the day um, for the remainder of the week, um, pot potato soup today, tomato soup tomorrow, and chicken noodle soup on Friday. Um, and then the dinner specials for the remainder of the week include today glazed ham or country fried steak with gravy, macaroni and cheese, and additional vegetables are collard greens or steamed carrots. On tomorrow, on Thursday, baked pork chop or lasagna, roasted red potatoes, grilled asparagus or buttered corn. Um, there's no uh, dinner service on Friday, and of course the Saturday um, special menu has already been provided. So um, enjoy your dining, of course, all week. Um, 
So of course we look forward to you uh, joining us on Monday for another exciting community engagement update um, with details on line dancing, the Reader's Theater live performance, lyrics by the lake, um, and details on the upcoming Richfield Living Open House tours and sign up for limited seats. Uh, we will have those participating in those two events, the Reader's Theater um, performance. Performers will appear with me on Wednesday of next week and um, hopefully the um, art tour participants, um, some of those will, will appear with me on the following week. Your community engagement calendar for May will be available this week and details um, regarding the um, vaccine clinic will be made available um, today as well. So check with your building manager if you have pre-registered for the vaccine clinic. If you um, did not pre-register, um, you uh, will have to wait till the next uh, vaccine clinic to participate. So um, look out for that information on Well Nested, as well as um, from your building manager or another team member who will be contacting you with information. So, today is Administrative Professionals Day in which we honor and recognize those who support the efforts of their colleagues and team members. So in celebration of Administrative Professionals Day, the quote from the Jar of Awesomeness is by Joseph Adams, and it states, no one is more cherished in this world, world than someone who lightens the burdens of others. Thank you. And of course, we sincerely thank you for all you do. I hope you'll have a wonderful Wednesday. We look forward to seeing you here for um, Cornhole today and enjoy the rest of your week. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Richfield dates back to 1919 when a group of women saw the need to provide the rural